vicious thing. Survival isn't such a distant prospect. I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? There. Can you see it? Just a dumb boar. You're relieved. Until you see the flash of a dagger. Don't we? I saw you on the ship. Free. Scuttling about. You're in league with them, aren't you? Those tentacle... Ah! Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark, busy streets. You try to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. What was that? What's going on? It's those tentacled monsters. Whatever they did, whatever they put in us, just created a connection. They took you too. I saw it during whatever just happened. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> A kindred spirit. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. My, my. You've been busy. So, did you learn anything about these worms while wandering the ship? Turn us into... Ha! <laughs> Of course, it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although... It hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, someone that can control these things, there might still be time. You know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And anyone that can crash a mine flare ship and walk away 
Seems like a good person to know. All right. I accept. Lead on. Mind Flayer. And it's hurt. That thing's bound to be dangerous even if in... You approach the dying Gake. The foul thing is at your mercy. And you would have its head. You could end its life here and now. If only you didn't feel... Compassion. Compassion. You can't move. Can't think. Thinking is mercifully done for you. It will be a joy to serve. To die for it an honor. It's possessing your mind. Forcing you to... Love it. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Goblins over there. Worth checking for supplies, maybe. Mm. Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. I hear shouting. I need a shovel to dig this up. in. Zevlor's orders. That pack of goblins will be on us any second. What's going on? Goblins are on our tail. Open the gate, Zevlor, now. You let goblins here? Where is the druid? Please, there's no time. Nine hells! Open the gates!
bleed every last one of you! That was the last of them. Inside! All of you! More may follow! Open the gate! Made for the sole purpose of Damn slaughter. Them. They were tenacious. I wonder what they wanted here, other than bloodshed. I just wonder if the grubby little beasts have any friends. Blame you for locking us out. There are children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too! Unbelievable! And who the hell are you again? Show some respect. This woman saved your pathetic life. Well, I didn't ask for any goddamn help. Please, you were begging me to open the gate. Anything to save yourself, you coward! The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. With a thunk, the armored man collapses, unconscious. Enough. 
The goblins have found us. No doubt the beasts will be back. We need to pack up and leave. Immediately! <laughs> <laughs>